Hey guys, on today's video, I'm going to teach you how to fix this mistake. So if you guys go up to your app store and updates and there's nothing loading up, although you know you have updates that are here and that's because I can see that there's eight. So there's a little number on top of my app store saying eight updates available. However, I go to them, there's nothing. You can refresh this. You guys can close your app store like so. So if I close it up totally like that and refresh it again, it's still gonna say this. So it's a glitch from Apple, it's nothing from you guys, okay? So don't worry about that. What we need to do is just tap up here on the top right hand side. You guys will see that picture, it might be your name or whatever picture you guys chose for your Apple ID. Just tap right there and you guys will see this, your Apple ID plus password. And that's exactly what you guys need to do right now is type in that information or if you don't have one, create one at this point, which is down here below. You guys will see it says create new app ID. So you can go ahead and do that or type in the one that you guys have right now. However, for some of you that may not work. The next step is to do a soft reset. So that, all that means is holding your home button plus your power button until you guys see the whole thing resetting. So that means a black screen. And then what we're gonna see is an Apple logo loading bar and that's actually loading everything back up. It's not erasing everything, so your photos will still be there, all your apps will be there, all your information, emails. Don't worry about that. It's just a soft reset, like restarting your computer. That's technically what we're doing with your iPhone, iPad, or Touch. After that, everything should be fine. After we see that black screen, that Apple logo, and we just let go of our home button plus power button, they should start up, and we should see our app store. So let's just go right into our app store. And right now everything should be fixed. So if I go up to updates, finally, I can see those eight updates and finally click on update all if I want to update them all or one at a time. Anyways, that should fix your problem right now. It's just a small glitch. It's just about having to restart your iPhone, iPad, or touch. Doesn't matter what you guys have. It's the same fix for all of them. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write them down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.